and welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. Interleague Baseball on MLB The Show. It's the Los Angeles Angels going up against the Atlanta Braves. First pitch coming your way next. And now, your 2003 So just about set and pitching in this game. Kyle Wright, what's the word on him? Well, last time out, thought it was going to be pretty good, but wasn't able to make it out of the second inning. A real shocker. So he's fresh, and having had an opportunity to look at that last start, I expect him to be a lot better in this one. Here's David Fletcher. Three, two on the way. In the air, left side. Henry calls it in, and there's one away. The left Taylor Ward, the next to hit for the Angels. Yeah, Righty delivers. In the air, left field. Two away down. Batting third, the center field. Now it's Hunter Renfro. Swing and a high fly ball out there towards left field. And makes the play, and that's out number three. Angels strand a couple, and now the Braves will get their first crack at it. No score. It's Major League Baseball on the show. Grounder into the outfield for a knock. And they strike first as they take a 1 0 lead. So he gets two milestones with that hit, his first big league knock, and he drives in his first run as well. Yeah, you love to get both of those out of the way with just one swing of the bat, and it makes the special moment even more special. It's not just an individual accomplishment when you're also driving in a run for your team. That's an at-bat he's never going to forget. Here Matt is Matt Olson. The first one base. home run shy of 200 for his career. Olsen. It's great to get on the board in the first frame of the ball game, but here's an opportunity for them to really open things up with a couple of runners on. Over to Fletcher. And that's two. So it's one run on three hits, no errors, and one left on. End of the first from Truist Park. It's the Braves one and the Angels nothing. So one out, nobody on. And next for the Angels, Anthony Rendon. Leading the AL in batting average. One down, base is empty. Lifted in the air, out to left. That takes care of Rendon. And a couple of quick outs. Batting it. The third base is Gio. Hunter Renfro at the plate. Fly to left his first time up.
And that one is lifted in the air. He's under it. Brings it in. And there's one down. Anthony Rendon making his way to the plate. Glide out his first time. Definitely wants to stay out of the double play here. Ball on the ground in the infield. Should be an inning-ending double play. 0-2 now. Left field. Henry racing. Makes the catch. Yeah, that was a wasted RBI opportunity, but competitor like him he is looking forward to making up for it in his next at bat back at truest park bottom of the fourth so now to the plate for atlanta darius henry this is a guy you got to keep an eye on when he digs in definitely been known to drop a drag bunt from time to time and he's pretty good at it chris yeah and he creates a, a sense of urgency for the defense because of the speed because of the ability to put down that bunt Slice the other way. That's a base hit. Man aboard on the leadoff single. And there you go. Nice hit. Seems like he got exactly what he was looking for right there. Off the bat, that one registered at 105 miles per hour, man. That is smoking. And these days you hear it all the time, but the numbers just don't lie. If you can drive a ball like that, more often than not, you're picking up a knock. Next offering popped in the air, right field. Renfro makes the catch, and there's one away. Lefties can definitely be a little pull happy up there, especially with pitches that they see pretty well. That was a good example. He hooked an outside pitch, hit that ball in the air to right, just not with much authority. Hit weakly on the ground towards second. Over to Fletcher. Not in time at first. It's a fielder's choice. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball. And next for L.A., Taylor Ward. Three-pitch strikeout last time up. Got to put up more of a fight in this one. Fletcher stands at first with one out. In the air, left field. He's under it. He's got it. And there are two outs. And now batting Mike Trout. If you don't get ahead in the count, you can forget about having any success against him. And a pitch. Ripped to third, but handled. And that'll end the inning. Angels leave one, and it remains 1 0. Bottom of the inning, here's the left fielder, Darius Henry. The left fielder, Darius Henry. Henry measures six feet even, only 18 years old, and he was a third round pick in 2023 well struck right field and it hits the fence it's a double third hit of the night for him he was all over that one fastball pretty much middle middle and that's what you fall asleep dreaming about as a hitter so no surprise he put a great swing on it and now it's Matt Olson's turn to hit and Boog, I'd say he's doing His next home run will be the 200th in his career. It would be pretty cool to see it right here. The 0-2. Bounce to the right. He takes it on his own. One away, bottom of the sixth. Good late bite on that slider. Got the hitter out in front, rolled over on it. Exactly what he was supposed to do. And now it's Travis Darno with the plate. One note on Travis Darno. He was drafted by the Philadelphia Phillies in the first round. Twice he was traded for Cy Young Award winners. Roy Halladay as he moved from the in the air right field. Out. 
number two. The center field, number five, Will Myers now. Here's a rip to short, but he's there for the third out. One left for Atlanta, but they're on top, 1-0. And next for Atlanta, Darius Henry. Drove it off the wall last time, just missed out on a home run. That one deep left field and forget it. His first homer in the majors, and they're going to have to send somebody to get that ball for him. Always such a special moment. You know this is one of the biggest thrills of his life. He's got to be floating around the bases right now. Yeah, he'll remember every detail of that at bat for years, as he should. It's a true once-in-a-lifetime event. Now, Boone, there's so many times when a young player might wonder if he's ever even going to get to the big leagues and do something like this. Well, he doesn't have to wonder anymore. Another game to bed. Sweet dreams, everyone. 2 nothing. your final here in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show, thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chomby. Talk to you soon. The final line for the Flower Bowl game for the victorious Atlanta Braves. He's just hit his first career home run. Carlos Pena, you hit 286 home runs in your career. What do you remember about home run number one? Well, the first home run I hit went the opposite way, so that's good hitting right there, Jake. That's right. I got a pitch out over the plate. Gil Heredia threw me a fastball out there, and I crushed it. Black out that left center field. And then that same game, I went deep again uh, versus Vizcaino for my second homer of the game. So it was a two-homer night for me. Were you able to track down the ball? No, can you believe that? Whoever has my home run ball, my first homer ball, I'm going to give it back. Come now, how, how much tougher <laughs> is it to hit a home run at this level as opposed to other levels of professional baseball? Well, you know what? When you're between the lines and on the, in the batter's box, you know, everything becomes the same, right? You just have to see the ball hit it, get good contact. So that's the same. I'm just talking about the pressure yeah. around you makes it that much harder. And, of course, the competition is better on the mound. So the likelihood of you going placata in the big leagues is, you know, lower than in... Well, I'll speak from uh, getting in the box. Even though I was a pitcher, it was hard enough for Oflo to make contact. Making contact for some major league pitcher is a very tough thing to hit a homer even tougher. Yeah, three home Good runs hit. in Jake Peavy's career, including Look one out. against Brad Penny. Where? Dodger Stadium. Look at that. There you go. <laughs> That's a memorable That's homer. <laughs> Listen, nobody's going to sit there and say the kid can't have his stay in the sun. Mom and dad in the stands. 
major league debut, but take it easy. The sport is littered with these hot shots who come up, get all excited, maybe even have a couple of decent days, but baseball's 162 games. Cream rises to the top, and then all of a sudden, after 20, 30 games, he fizzles, loses his confidence, and we ship him out of town. Be careful.